Hey guys, my name's Alistair and I'm the bassist of a band called Depth Charge. Depth Charge have been together um, and doing what we do now for about seven years or so. Uh, the band basically consists of myself and my brother Aaron, who is the guitarist of the band. Um, we've been playing together for that same amount of time. Depth Charge itself is an instrumental band. Um, this has come about mainly because we never ever found a singer. We used to have a singer at one point and it didn't really work out so well. As time went on, uh, we, myself and Aaron basically just started writing material um, to the point where we decided, hey, this stuff stands up pretty well by itself. That realisation came about five or six years of those seven years ago. And since then we have just been writing instrumental material. The tracks are very progressive, some of them are quite lengthy, and we find ourselves okay with that. But it's never really bothered us. At this time, and since about July of 2011, we have been without a drummer. So this is basically what this video is for. A number of the drummers who have been interested in the band have found themselves either unprepared or underestimating exactly what it is that we are actually looking for. And I'm hoping that this video will answer a lot of the questions that have regularly been asked by people who have got in contact with us about being the drummer in the band. One of the first questions is probably where do we live? Now, on the adverts that I've posted out online, I have said that we live in a town called Kirkcaldy in Fife, which is on the east coast of Scotland. Now, we don't actually live in Kirkcaldy, we actually live in a cottage outside of Kirkcaldy, which is ideal for us because we have no neighbours, it's nice and quiet, and we can make as much noise as we want, as loud as we want, for as long as we want. And that's always a good thing to, for a band, right? Now, with us being out of the way, uh, we are obviously wanting to be able to travel, uh, to go to gigs, shows, festivals at one point, I, I'm sure. And we are very much invested in this band to the point where we will travel almost anywhere to play a gig, to play a show. And we are basically looking for somebody who can fit that sort of mentality. A lot of drummers up to this point who have been interested in the band find out where we live and say it's far too far, which is fine. I mean, if people don't want to travel, they don't want to travel. But we're looking for somebody who does, and of course somebody who will travel with us when that actually comes to having the opportunity to do it. We also get asked about our gigging experience. Um, as a full band, we haven't got one hell of a lot compared to a lot of bands out there. Uh, but that's probably because we've not had a drummer for one hell of a lot of the time that we've been together. In 2011 we played in Aberdeen, Edinburgh, Kennethment, Glasgow. And we had offers from elsewhere in the country um, to go and play in places like Dumfries, Newcastle, uh, Brighton, Leeds. There were quite a number of places which unfortunately we had to turn down. Um, purely because our drummer left the band. Shortly after we got ourselves into a position to actually start regularly gigging. So we are looking for a drummer who is up for investing themselves into a project as much as we already are. As far as ability goes, um, the drums in places are difficult. Um, we do need somebody who plays double pedal. And we do need somebody who has a little bit of music theory. Our music is very progressive and as a result we would naturally be looking for a drummer who is into progressive drums. Able to appreciate the small nuances of the you know the quietest splash as well as the biggest china. You know, they, they, they all have their place, they all have an effect. We're obviously looking for somebody who's um, who sees that. Uh, rather than just being somebody who thinks themselves a drummer who is used to just keep time and see themselves as just playing the same thing over and over again in a song.
We also need somebody who isn't scared of being in an instrumental band. A lot of people are put off by being in an instrumental band because they can't really see how any listener would uh, relate to the music. We've always enjoyed writing the way we do purely because we don't have a singer and therefore we have the ability to make our instruments articulate a melody or a rhythm in a way that we wouldn't really have much room for if we had a sing. We look at the fact that we are an instrumental band as a benefit rather than a hindrance. It also gives us a near infinite amount of scope to experiment with what we do when it comes to writing new material. So the way we see it, we're basically looking for a drummer who enjoys playing what they play enough to actually want to take it somewhere, who enjoys progressive music, enjoys being part of progressive music, enjoys writing, isn't scared of uh, travelling to practice here at the cottage, because obviously it doesn't cost us anything to practice here. And above all, we're looking for somebody who's dedicated to what they do. Uh, this isn't just uh, you know like a, an everyday hobby or something that we do at the weekends. Uh, we have a lot of plans for this band. We have just recently recorded an album, uh, which isn't out yet. Um, we are in the process of mixing it and finishing it off through the band room. But that is something that's in the very, very near future for us. And naturally we want to be able to play and, and tour to promote that album and get ourselves in a place where we can, um, you know, make a lot of friends, make a lot of contacts and of course develop ourselves as a band from that point on. <laughs> Outside of the band though, you know, we're just regular guys, we play computer games, we love movies, enjoy a laugh. Usually they're penis jokes. I'll give you the drums of guitar. And you know, we consider ourselves quite easy to get along with. We're just two guys who take the band seriously. and are looking for somebody who can do the same. So if you are interested at all in getting in touch with us to, you know, perhaps be in the band, you can catch us on Twitter, you can get us through Facebook, you can also access our Reverb Nation page, as well as uh, get us through uh, maybe posting a comment or leaving a private message to our YouTube channel.